We love black girls. I think Black Girls Code empowers all of us. You wouldn't learn coding, web design, or app designing on a regular day, and it just gives you a chance to get a glimpse of what you can do. And it gives them a chance to feel like, oh, I'm all that. <laughs> What I really love about the Black Girls Code movement is that they see the potential, the great, vast potential in these young black girls. And not only do they see the potential, they're actually acting on it by making sure that they're serving these girls. And this week, the girls have been learning about entrepreneurship and business planning for mobile app development and they have been creating ideas for a mobile app that they would love to bring to market. So during the week of the camp we've been learning about App Inventor and all aspects of entrepreneurship and business development. The girls broke up into teams and they've been brainstorming ideas and working on prototypes, paper prototypes for their apps. Sometimes if you're on a page and if you want to go back to a page, sometimes when you press this, it actually brings you back to the home page. Uh, we put a back button at the top right there and instead of having the name right there, we were going to put it at the top. So have to Before I started with Black Girls Code, I didn't even know what HTML was, <laughs> let alone how to code in it. I didn't really know how to make a game, like the components of games. I didn't know what a sprite was. What they're teaching us is like really good to know. So if I ever want to make like my own mobile app, it'll be easier. It's a little bit difficult and it's very tiring, but we're doing a good job and we're learning about the field of marketing, what the people we're trying to get to want. So far I've made an app prototype, made like three tutorial apps, I was about to design a website. I think one of the big problems with inclusion is that I think our community is underestimated and the importance of having diverse perspectives in the room to build solutions, to talk about solutions, to take action, to change the world. Um, if you don't have these different perspectives in the room and these different experiences, then you're not going to build the best place. really important and awesome that Black Girls Code is here today and we have so many young women here today at Facebook with the opportunity to meet people who work at Facebook, work, meet engineers, meet people who work on our product, as well as just walk around campus and see what it looks like to work here. I know when I was their age I wish I had the same type of opportunity and access to visit companies like this to really open my eyes to understand what is possible. And it's also really cool because we're working with the Bay Area chapter of Black Girls Code and so we're literally in their backyard and it's awesome to be able to provide access to these young women to come here and just get to meet us and see what's possible for them in a few years. I got into programming actually not that long ago last summer um, because I come from a low-income family so my family actually couldn't afford to have our own computer at home until I was a freshman in high school and my public school did not offer any computer science classes so I was never actually to get into uh, programming as early as all of you guys. So you guys actually have a head start on me. And it's also very equalizing in a way because I didn't, I mean I only started last summer and I'm already interning at Facebook. So I think that it's definitely something that anyone can do and anyone can get behind. And it's just a very empowering um, area, not only for you who are learning the program, but also the impact you can have on other people as well. 
it's absolutely imperative that we as a company do all that we can to figure out how we can make technology uh, more accessible to all the communities out there. The biggest thing that the girls got out of this week was a confidence in presentation and really owning the work that they did. So we decided to make an app called Get Green. My team, we're making an app called Summertime Fun. Our app is about cleaning. Basically, it will tell you what to clean your room with. So our app is about recycling and how to keep the earth clean. Which that flower is basically, you could scan or take a photo of a flower and the definition will pop up and if it's edible, like to eat, and if it's harmful. I've done a lot of work and I'm continuing to do a lot of work on women. and the fact that women and men do not have equal positions in our society yet. Because again, technical fields are where a lot of our leaders come from, technical fields are much better paid, and the percentage of women graduating from computer science right now in this country is 13%. 13% for every 100 people graduating with a computer science degree, 13 of them are women. But these are jobs where you really make a difference. You build technology, you build something like Facebook, and then the whole world can use it. And so I think on any level, whether it's future financial security for your families, whether it's future just fun for you, or future meaning for the work you do, having a technical degree, technical background is so important. We know that the women who make it through, the girls who make it through, they are just as good at this as the kids. They always were. They just don't get the same encouragement. And they don't see the same role models. So you can do this because you have this amazing opportunity. You do it not just for yourself, but you do it and you become the role model. So I hope you're taking full advantage of this great opportunity. I'm thrilled we're able to host you at Facebook. They're working with these girls. They're, they're teaching them these skills and they're, they're allowing them to build amazing things. I want to reach everyone.